Uh, we've installed a uh, submarine model and uh, we're doing this work in collaboration with our colleagues, uh, Lab of St. John's, the Ocean um, Coastal Rivers Engineering uh, Laboratory. They, uh, this is a, a tow tank model. It's a hydrodynamic model that they test in their um, in their in their uh, water tank or tow, water tow tank in uh, St. John's, Newfoundland. What you're going to see today is uh, we're going to be we're going to show you a, an example of uh, the surface flow visualization. We're going to be painting the model from uh, station two, which you see there, uh, all the way up to the nose, and uh, we're going to be applying a surface flow paint. The, you paint the nose with a surf, surface flow visualization fluid. We're going to put the wind on, and you'll see that uh, you'll see that paint start to follow the uh, the uh, surface flow pattern that develops between uh, that, that that the flow causes over the over the surface of the model. The objective of our test is to compile or gather. Uh, force and moment measurement data, but primarily surface flow uh, information uh, for um, St. John's and for our colleagues at DRDC, that's the uh, uh, Defense Research and Development of Canada. These guys are, that group is in Halifax, and they're going to use that information primarily to, uh, to provide uh, validation for their computational flow dynamics. Um, that is, that they simulate uh, the conditions that we're doing uh, experimentally, and the information we provide uh, will help them validate their uh, their computational simulation. And once they achieve that, then they can use those simulations to do anything they want.